Hi, I'm Dave Shank. I am with Two Structures Home. I'm the production manager over here. Today we're in uh, our Arcadia, Oklahoma. We're standing on one of our new builds. What I'm standing in the middle of is a post-tension foundation. So a post-tension foundation is a series of cables and you can see the colored insulation. And what that allows us to do is after the concrete's poured, tighten those cables and really make a solid, solid foundation. It is the best in the industry. What makes post-tension the best in the industry is that it is an active foundation that is constantly applying pressure from the outside of the foundation to the inside of the foundation. It's like a series of clamps that are always on your home and constantly keeping it together. Cracks don't happen in post-tension foundations. Two Structures uses post-tension uh, for a few different reasons. One of the main reasons is the warranty that it provides. We have an engineer who draws this foundation up for us. Then the installation contractor comes out and lays all of the cables, all of the rebar that I'm standing around uh, is placed according to an engineer that's certified and licensed and provides us a stamp set of plans. The foundation up, if you're gonna build on a solid foundation, storm shelter location. So when we pour these, uh, we, we pour it all and in including that space there so that either now, uh, during the build, or later, if the homeowner chooses to install a storm shelter later, there aren't any cables that can damage and affect the entire foundation. It's easy to install one after the home is complete. So one of the things you're gonna notice is all of this black plastic that I'm standing on. The black plastic is a polyethylene sheet. It's not to be confused with bisqueen. This doesn't deteriorate over time and it keeps moisture from below ground coming into the home, which makes your air quality better inside the home for the life of the home. Right here on the outside of the forms, you can see these cables that are protruding from the forms. This is the portion of the cable that the company comes out after the concrete has set up for seven to 10 days and they pull each one of these cables with approximately 30,000 pounds of pressure. So 30,000 PSI. This is what keeps the foundation together. As you can see, we've got plumbing coming up through the slab and what have you. And right here in the middle of this square form, rectangular formed location is the shower drain. So this would be the master bathroom with a recessed shower so that there is a curbless shower in the final Really appreciate you watching the video. Hope it was informative. Uh, any more information you can find on our website.